Hello everyone, this is Redact in this game. It is called the Captain Homedict. So we're a bit stranded on a planet. We lost some of our stuff, we need to find it. So then we're going to help out some lady and her daughter to fix their well or whatever. I think that's what's going on. We have to deal with this evil governor. So let's give it a go. Okay, so let's go outside. So we need to go to the store. Get the groceries over at the store. Okay. No. It's not the thing to do. There we go. Shop area then. Goods and cargo, I assume. Oh. That thing's... I thought I'd fix that. Well, at least that's still ajar. Maybe he fixed it while I was away. this while he's doing the thing. Please sir, don't move that bell will you? I need to keep track of my customers. Can I not? Please sir, okay. How did I do it last time? I don't remember anymore. Alright, let's go and talk to him. Let's get something for this is the mower. Oh yes, of course. Got it all prepared under the desk. Okay, let's take those. See you later. Oh, he needs to be doing the water dispenser, doesn't he? Let's just do that. I think that's what I did last time. Oh no! I'm so sorry! you doing? I told you not to touch that. I'm so sorry. I apologize. Yes. <laughs> so hopefully when it's night time, we need to try and catch that parrot too, I think. So when she's not around, we can climb up, get through that window. What's that? Nothing. I get those flowers. Power it was here, if I remember. Oh, there, it's up there. How do I catch the parrot? Or is that that's not the right parrot? I don't know. I have no idea. All right, let's go. Let's go back to that house. I'm sure the game will guide me somehow. Right, into house area, let's go. Can we talk to her now? How do they? Oh, hi. No, alright. Poor condition. Alright, so we need to try and fix that. I guess if we talk to the lady. your groceries. Here are your groceries. Thank you. Wouldn't you like to help me fix the house? It'll probably take the rest of the day though. Yeah, sure. Oh, well, that's wonderful. Me and Lars uh, will really appreciate it. So what am I doing? Wow, this is the first time I've ever seen Homedic do work. I've been watching him for a long time. Good work, everyone. Time to come inside. Dinner is ready. Oh, at last. I'm starving. Come sit down and join us, Thomas Homedic. There we go. Now, let's say Grace. Bless his food and the people who prepared it. 
I'm very pleased to welcome Homedic to our meal today and hope he will get his menu back soon. As we'll offer thanks for the bounty we've received, they will come. There. Let's eat. Chew properly, Homedic. Did Frank at the store mention our debt to him? No. We could only grow our own food. We wouldn't have to be so dependent on Frank's blessed heart. Okay, is it hard to grow crops in these parts? Not in general, but our plot has given up for some reason. Have you had problems for a long time? No, this is the first season. It used to be a great plot to grow food. It seems to be just us. Uh, what do you grow? I mean, you grow earth apples and root berries. May not be dinner for kings and queens, but it would do for us. Okay, what do you think's wrong with your crops? There's some strange flavour in the food, and then both Lasso and I fell ill with a fever. Don't really know what is wrong. No farm myself, so it would be a weak guess at best. But I had Sister Patty down for a look. Do you know these kinds of things? They say that she was spawned from an earth apple seed blessed by the Almighty herself. So, pretty comfortable around crops then. Oh yes, dear Homedict. She did what she could and consecrated the earth. This was delicious. You sure know how to cook. Thank you. What is it with the governor? He's an evil old dog. Lassa, he is not. Willie is, however, uh, stubborn and misguided. Yes, mother, like an evil old dog. <laughs> Lassa! He seems to be infatuated with you. Yes, he's possessed by an illusion that I need help to get by. Views on women are old-fashioned and quite tiresome, actually. How did he become governor? Simply put, he was born to it. He's the son of the former governor. With the church supporting his position, it was always written in the stars. I don't seem to like him very much. As far as I'm concerned, I'm still married to my husband. And no man, no matter how rich or powerful, can change that. Not even the mighty homedict. He's mean and grumpy. Uh, do I really want to ask that? Yeah, where is the father then? Don't mind me asking. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to. No, it's all right. I was just thinking about something else. His name was Tamian. Unless I was only a baby when he went missing. Oh, is he down the well or something? What happened? Well, Tamian was kind of the man that questioned everything. He's never afraid to raise his voice for honesty and truth against injustice of war greed. He always said, the question is the answer. Sad of me to say it, but I believe he finally asked one question too much. So I believe the Almighty finally had enough of him and his question. Oh. Soon after Lasso was born, he got obsessed with the night. As you know, the night is a sacred time, forbidden time. But he just said that truth never damages a cause that is just. No child should have to live in ignorance. He spent most of his time over at the library with his research. A while after he went missing, I went through the diary to find the clue of what might have happened. Suggested that you've been outside during the dark hours. Oh my goodness. Loved him more than life itself, but his unbound and always thirsty spirit was not meant for this land. I'm sorry, Samoa. Do you think I could see your, f your husband's diary? I'm sorry, don't let anyone see those unho unholy writings. Lock them away for safekeeping. Just that it's way too dangerous and I wouldn't want to upset the Almighty again. Thank you so much for the food. You're welcome, Thomas. Really earned your food today after all the work you did. I think I'll start cleaning things up now. And Lassa, time for bed. Right, so what do I have? I've got the library, so I can get into the library. I've got some books. But yeah, that was just a random book. I've got some flowers, some fruit. I don't think it's gonna do anything. Painting. I can't go into that. That's their bedroom. So clues anywhere else? Not here. Those are shelves. The table. So it's probably in a cupboard somewhere. So 
to walk this way. Yeah, I remember there being a locked thing. Please don't touch that, Thomas. It's the place I got my husband notes. Probably they could be very dangerous. Right, so how am I going to open that? She must have the key. Just finish up here, then me and Lester will go to bed. There's lots of work for us tomorrow. Okay, is there something outside now? Because I've obviously got to go outside. Sorry, Thomas. Realize you've been through a lot lately. But we never go outside during the night. You don't. I mean, we don't. Now, since you don't remember, it's our deepest belief that the almighty Tam made the night for herself. I don't think you want to be disrespectful to her wishes. There's no time to anger her. Of course, ma'am. Right, so we've got to figure out a way to get outside when it's night time. When they're finally asleep. But it's not night outside. Okay, let's see if there's something upstairs I've missed then. Maybe this used to be the husband's office, I imagine. Yeah, it's got all that stuff in it. So can I go out the window? I see a back garden. Small town with stone houses. So I could go out the window if I had like a ladder or something. Hmm. That's a painting. Don't care. It's a sacred book we read. It's on the green board. Still can't read it, I imagine. Time, time's trying to write to... Maybe he can't wake up at night. Eat hot food before going to bed. Something before going to bed. Not going to bed at all. Set time piece to something. Use time piece to... No, use... To something. Right, so he was trying to get outside during the night. So that is the same as what what's her face said. Old school. So we have a signing of interest lives here. Yeah, that's the husband. Can we do something? I don't know what I would do with this lab. Okay. Alright. So the only thing I think I can do is sleep. She won't let me go outside yet. I think I've got to do something to get out the window and then have a look around outside. Can I... I'm just going to sit here. Okay, I'll have a look at the painting. Is there, is there clues in the painting? It's drawing of a tree. Okay, let's talk to her, see if she's going to bed. Okay, lots of work for us tomorrow. Wait, she's not going to let me go. She's not going to go before I do. So I guess we go sleep. Because I can't see anything else that we can do. Alright, let's go to bed. Do you want to go to sleep? No, not really, but okay. Captain Fu soon fell asleep, very tired from all the manual labour during the day. Come on then, Homadie. You can't be lazy all day. Anything new? No. Right. I suppose we're going to help around the house. Good morning, Thomas. Good morning. How do you feel today? Remember anything yet? Uh, not really. A uh, few glimpses, maybe, here and there. That's too bad. I feel sorry for you. Didn't want to wake you before, but we usually go up and have breakfast just after sunrise. I'm reheating some porridge for you right now. Maybe I'll just get another clock for you to have upstairs that you can wake you up. Thank you. Have a seat, and I'll get you some breakfast. Anything changed? Don't think so. All right. Let's see breakfast. Here you go. Thank you.
Thank you so much. You're welcome. Thomas. Yes. Could you do me another favour today? Could you go to the store again and get me to deliver the groceries I've ordered? Of course. Thank you. Sigh. Maybe the governor's right, you know. Maybe I cannot manage this without marrying him. I can't understand we have all these problems all at once. And it's not only is our water supply undrinkable, crops grow very slowly as well. Maybe I can help somehow? I don't know how though. I have to solve these problems quite soon. Otherwise you won't be able to stock enough food and water for the winter. Because I have to give up this life soon. Think about Lasso, you know. Anyway, it's not your problem to fix. But if you have some idea how to help, I'm willing to listen. I'll have to come back to you on that. Don't worry about it. I'll figure, I'll figure something out. Right, so we need to go to the shop again. We can do something with that ladder. We need to figure out a way to get out of the window at night. I wonder how long I should stay on this planet. Maybe I should just agree to the governor's terms and get my stuff back. But on the other hand, this family could really use my help. Perhaps I could bring a sample of the soil back to my service table and analyze it. Oh, good idea. Hmm, I guess I'll update my list of problems. Well, that's a very good idea. I would never have thought of that. Yeah, let's go and check it out. What's the notebook say? Okay, and at least I can... Okay, Margaret, should I help with the garden soil? I should bring a soil sample to the service table to analyze it. Okay. I can't... I'm wondering, can I build... Some... Is there a ladder in the shed? Build of old lumber. Because I need to get out somehow. Unless there's a way to distract the store owner. Let's have a look. No expert in agriculture, but to me this all looks fine. Start moist and of normal consistency. Even smells like plants, soil should. Okay, let's take some. Uh, just take a small sample. Alright, that's in... Okay, soil sample. Okay, let's go. Into the city. Enter the city. Okay, there you go. Right, so we go all the way to the end. I'm wondering whether I can take the ladder from there. Let's go and have a look, see if I can do it. I'll probably reset the bell again. Because he's extremely annoying like that. Right, she's outside. No, I don't want to do that. Yeah, there's this ladder. Excuse me, sir. Don't think you're allowed to climb up there. Oh, I'm sorry, ma'am. Yeah, so if I go inside, is the bell reset? Not this time. That I can't move. No, I don't need to worry about that. Because I already did it. I want to get upstairs somehow. This will have to be moved. Everything is very neatly packed into paper boxes of different sizes. They all have handwritten labels. Oh, timey. It's like they've been thrown back in time. Can I move that ladder to here? Don't think so. What is... What's that? Oh, that's a sign. Don't think there's anything else I can touch. Shells. Okay, let's go. Go out. Oh, you inside my shop? I'm so sorry. I didn't see you go inside. It's fine. Let's go. Let's analyze this soil. Find out it's been poisoned somehow. Benton. Must be the name of this town. Okay, let's see what else is around. It's that hole in the ground. Already dug up by some small rodent. Can I touch it? I can only look at it. Fine. Let's go. Oh, another hole in the ground. Oh! Catch it! Catch it, Harmadic! 
No. What are you doing about some small rodent? Oh, there's a wild bird. Bird's nest. It's like the same bird that was outside the store before. Can I offer it food and capture it somehow? Maybe it would like some tree, yes? Wow, yes! Really wanted that fruit. I'll just bring him with me for a while. No, we're going to keep him forever. A beautiful parrot. Can I go and have a look? Completely boarded up. There's no way for me to get in there. Alright. Let's go then. Get some more flowers. That would be lovely. Ah, oh, look how beautiful it is. I'm going to take the flowers. I might need it for some sort of potion making later. I can poison the governor. Yes. A blue flower at Skylip. Right, there was no gold flowers. That's unfortunate. Nothing. Fine. Keep going. Nope. Oh! Lisa is here. Should we speak to her? I suppose we could. We can get some more fruit. Yeah, let's speak to her. Yes, get some more fruit. Lovely, delicious fruit. It's all mine now. Can't have it. Oh, what's that? Hole in the ground. Hello. Oh, is that you? Oh, hi. Yeah. Didn't expect to see you up here. Needed to be alone. Everything okay? Yeah, it's fine, thank you. Are you crying? No. Well, maybe. What are you doing up here? Nothing really, just thinking. Something happened? Yes. Or no, I don't know. Did you see something strange up here? What? Sniff? No. Why do you ask? Uh, just checking. Come now. Tell me what's wrong. Oh, alright. It's really the governor. I really don't like him. He treats mother so badly. Yes, I've noticed that. They do and mother discuss a date to come visit his estate. I know what that means, and I hate it. I understand. We will figure something out. I am working on it. So glad we found you, Homedict. So am I. Why are you up here, by the way? Just checking around my surroundings to see if I recognize anything. And do you? For a moment I thought I recognized this tree, but no. Just another tree, I guess. So nothing then. Not a thing. Yep. So. Just really keep looking around for something familiar. Yes. Good idea. I'll stay here a while longer before I head home. Okay, see you back home then. So there's another hole in the ground, but that's just the rodent. I don't know, are we supposed to do something with the rodent? Oh, get him, get him, get him, get him, get him! Homedict! Probably dug up by some small rodent. How am I going to get the rodent, and what do I need it for anyway? She's very close to this thing. Okay, let's put the soil sample in there. Pollution's detected. What the? It's a type 2 pesticide substance. No wonder this soil is as dead as dust. There's no way this is a natural phenomenon. Someone did a really good job here sterilizing the soil. Good news is I think I know how to clean up this pollution. I'll just write down the steps in the notebook I got earlier. I can get hold of the necessary ingredients on this planet. Okay. Keeping the parrot. Nothing will grow in the garden while it's polluted with this substance. Could create a soil purification powder. We need ammonia, sugar, a small amount of gold. When I've got that flour. That should do enough. Hopefully. Alright, so we need to go and do that. 
See if we can find the ingredients somewhere. See, talk to her if she's got any of those ingredients. You still here? Yes, I don't have any chores right now, so... No problem, girl. See you back home. Right, she's no help. There might be stuff back at the house. But I'm going to go to the store, because I need to pick up... Oh, no, catch it! Catch it! Home it. Ah. So I need to I need to pick up something, right? My problems. Yeah, I was supposed to go. I'm pretty sure I was supposed to go to the shop. Right? Yes, I know that. Get the groceries over at the store. Yeah. All right, let's let's do that. We can ask the guy at the store whether he has ammonia and whatever other stuff. Can you board it up? Can't do that. That's fine. Hole in the ground. Dug up. There's another hole in the ground somewhere. Okay, you've got to grab it this time. I'm going to grab it, grab it, grab it. Damn it. Maybe I need to set a trap. Oh, grab it. Grab it. Hmm. See if it pops up his head. Nope. Nope. It just looks at the hole. Let's look at the, at the animal. Okay. No, it's not. It's not picking up at the animal. Alright, that's fine. Go and get the groceries. Maybe the husband has stuff back at the house. But I'll ask at this shop. It's a blacksmith. What's back here? Don't know. I see we can do something with the bird. Maybe the birds won't squawk if I come in at night or something. Don't know. Ah, oh, he came. Annoying. It's fine, though. Do you have vinegar for sale? Sure, they go for 25 money per bottle. I don't have that much. I'm not sell you for that, for that less. Oh, of course, I understand. Is there any way to earn money around here? Hmm. I guess I could pay you a fair price for a number of items I need. I got nothing. I don't even own the clothes I am wearing. It's okay. These things you can harvest around town. Ah, okay. I've been waiting to get a chance to pick up some sky lips to give to Ingrid. Get me a bunch of, say, like eight flowers. I can pay you 20 money. That's not enough! And I can also use about four tree fruits if I'm to bake that pie. Pay you 20 for those as well. Got it. Anything else? Looking for some fresh meat. Nice to shoot or catch some wildlife. I could probably buy that from you as well. Good to know. Oh. You heard that? I think it's about to rain. Oh no. That's what I thought. Okay. Let's... Vinegar ammonia. Ammonia? Yes, I have that, but there's a small problem. You see... Is it such a nasty substance? I've locked it all in my safe behind the counter. It's a bit embarrassing. But I've yet again misplaced my key to the safe. The key! The key! Oh yes, feathers. Where's the key, girl? Crack. Sigh. It's usually helps me put with stuff like this. But ever since Chico went astray, she's been too sad and distracted. Chico? Chico is Feather's life partner. Aha! Uh -huh. So, what happened? Let them fly free here in the store when the customer forgot to close the door. Chico flew out and I was afraid he can't find his way back. Okay. Well, let's give the guy... Uh, let, let me get something. Get the groceries. Of course. Put it all prepared here under the desk. Right. 
right. Okay, so I should be able to give him tree fruit. You wanted to buy some fruit? Yes, of course. These are perfect. Here is your money. Nice. Alright, so the game just saved there, so I'm going to end the episode here. And I will be back next time where we will sell the flowers, try and sort out this bird problem. And then... Yeah, we need to get to the statue. Maybe that's got gold in it. We need gold also for our recipe, right? So we give that a go. But we will do that next time. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And I will be back with another episode soon. Take care, everyone.